Hello my soccer universe. I promised I'm gonna wear a different jersey for the Bundesliga preview of all the what to watch and yeah, I decided let's put on the new cone jersey, which incidentally is the first time I'm actually wearing it. I unpacked it, but I never wore it. It fits quite well and I absolutely love it. So I want to put the Bundesliga jersey on because let's see what the Bundesliga is dishing up this week and and we get another game of Friday in Freiburg, this time against Gladbach. So Freiburg was losing to Leverkusen last week and let's see what Gladbach can dish up there. Uh, seems to be kind of an important game, especially for Gladbach to get uh, to keep the Champions League spot. We have then Leipzig against Paul Paderborn should be one sided and the big clash Leverkusen Bayern would be a lot more interesting if there was still a title at stake. I'm thinking Bayern has to play against Leverkusen, has to play against Gladbach. Um, and even if they lose those two and win everything else, they will get the title. So mm -hmm. the air is not, it's very much deflated, the Bundesliga. But yeah, it's an important game for Leverkusen. And paired with Gladbach, this could actually be a pre-decider for the final Champions League spot. Um, Frankfurt in a derby against Mainz. Can they back it up and really put Mainz into trouble? That will be uh, interesting. Uh, point this there's a uh, quite some rivalry between those two Düsseldorf against Hoffenheim is so and so and I have to say the Dortmund Hertha BSC is also kind of an interesting match because Hertha has been playing really 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 well and uh, Dortmund um, yeah also except even against Bayern where they didn't score they played well so that I totally understand that this is the late game on Saturday Sunday in the uh, early kickoff we get Werder against Wolfsburg um, a week and a half ago so I would have said it's clear for Wolfsburg, but then Wolfsburg lost at home to Frankfurt. Frankfurt beat Werder now. It could be tighter than it is, but uh, given that Werder is at home not all that great, probably Wolfsburg the favorite. Union Schalke has a slight reek of relegation battle, although both are probably still gonna avoid it. And then Köller is playing late against uh, away to Augsburg, uh, hoping to bounce back. They had a so-and-so actually going more to a bad start to the season. In Germany, we also have the second Bundesliga, still keeping with that one. Um, where, let's see, uh, Bielefeld against Nürnberg. If Nürnberg, Nürnberg just got relegated and is, is a relegation threatened again. So, um, kind of, Bielefeld almost can secure it there. Stuttgart against Osnabrück. Again, uh, under normal circumstances, it's an easy win. The big one is the highest foul uh, kill on Monday evening. That's a northern derby. That is also there's a, quite some an animosity in there that uh, is interesting. I also think Hannover, Heidenheim, it's not the... Um, you know, maybe there's a relegation spot at stake if Hamburg or Stuttgart uh, drop off. Portugal, we continue the round. I again have not included the results from Thursday because the moment I'm shooting, they have not been played yet. <laughs> so yeah, um, you will get those uh, on the uh, Monday summary uh, show, if you like. But we have um, on Friday, we have Santa Clara against Braga. So another big team goes in there. And yeah, Boavista, Morarense, maybe Rio Alapach, Passos de Ferreira. I'm the big guys have already played. Uh, it's kind of easing everyone in into the Portuguese league. I'm looking forward to the next round already um, and we'll see more. And then we have Austria where there are quite some deciding matchups. Um, in the relegation round, I'm really wondering what St. Pölten will do against Austria. Will they continue their great form? Um, on Sunday, it's Wolfsburg against Lusk. Um, get second against third and Lusk needs to bounce back on that one. Rapid Sturm is traditionally a huge matchup, but Sturm is not all that great, so I would expect a Rapid win there. But Wolfsburg against Lask, that's, I think, the big one there. So that was probably the last what to watch, where we are not talking about La Liga and Serie A. Talk about that one. What I am planning to do is, when I do my summary, I will do everything up until Sunday. So the um, Monday night game in the second Bundesliga, I will squeeze in when the, uh, in the midweek um, because I think there is less action and uh, there will be some time to talk about that one.
In any case, let me know what you'll be watching. I think in the Bundesliga, German Bundesliga is quite some stuff and I'm looking forward to Wolfsburg Lask. My last will bounce back. I am absolutely certain about that. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos like these and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that would be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated with all things that are rotating in my soccer universe. With that, I wish you a wonderful day. Bye.